In this video, I'm going to be holding Anthony Riley to his own words. He promised he's going to take down the videos against Soundly if anyone could prove that the vertical beams in the foreground do not cross over the way he says they should. So let's have a listen to what he said. I say that because that would be stupid. So Ron Burgundy says that Soundly recorded himself with a phone making this video and driving home and uploaded it live. Doesn't matter. Look at where the parallax is not present on the video. It has to be there. Don't care what Soundly shows. This is a law of physics. It's a straightforward law of physics. Those power, them posts have to cross over. End of discussion. They don't do it. It's proof that this is not a real footage. It's not real. It doesn't happen. Okay, so that's what he says. Them posts have to cross over. It doesn't do it. It's proof that it's not real footage. That's what he says at 127.31. Let's have a listen to what he says at all. Couple of seconds later. And it has to happen because it's the object closest to us, and that's why I did the homework. Now, now there we go. I'm Rick Anthony Riley. Yes, he did. You can watch his, his video of him recording himself. Yeah, it doesn't, that, that's, that's it doesn't matter. I'm Rick. It doesn't prove that this was a real photo, uh, a real video. What proves it's a real photo or a real video is parallax, and it is not on display here. Mm -hmm. So, sound is fucked up. He's done video three-dimensional animation, and you can see it, right? Bendy lines. Let's go on to the bendy lines. So okay. any, any ballers in chat can prove that, that Parallax doesn't um, affect the imagery in the foreground. Please do so. I look forward to all of your videos, and I promise you there won't be one. Any of you fuckers out there that think it's real, do a video. Show that Parallax... Okay. He's saying any of you people out there should do a video. Show that Parallax... ...doesn't move the things in the foreground the way we're saying it does... And then I will eat my words and I will apologize and I'll remove all the videos about fraudly. Well, these guys are never. Let's hear that again. Do a video. Show that Parallax doesn't move the things in the foreground the way we're saying it does. And then I will eat my words and I will apologize and I'll remove all the videos about fraudly. Now, I brought up this fact that he promised to, to apologize and this is what he wrote back. So I wrote over here he promised to delete all the videos against Sally. If anyone can demonstrate it's possible the vertical beams not to cross over, well, let's see if you keep your word. And then he writes, I didn't promise that at all. So over here, I actually say and show exactly what time he said he will he will um, delete all the videos against Soundly. So anyone watching this video, you can reference the times when he actually said this at around 1.28. Um, he said he will apologize and remove all the videos against Sally. So let's see if he keeps his word. If enough people tell him, enough people remind him, perhaps he will.